Well, you mentioned the Graftonauts earlier. That's a community for individuals who want to learn and better understand the graph, and they maybe have a non-technical background. So sometimes this is a community full of delegators, for example, but uh, you're a technical guy and you're involved in there. So it crosses over quite a bit, but maybe listeners don't remember or know what Curation Station is and that community. What can you share about that and, and what happens there? At Curation Station, we are actually monitoring any subgraphs that get deployed on mainnet. So whenever someone deploy a subgraph on, on mainnet, uh, we do a detailed and the proper research uh, to find out if that subgraph is going to generate query fees, if, if it's legal. So if that subgraph uh, is actually deployed by a real person or going to be utilized by a Take that to generate query fees. Then we encourage curators to signal that subgraph, uh, so they can get a portion of uh, of query fees. Uh, actually, uh, cur- curators are like uh, uh, curators uh, signal a subgraph, so indexers can then index that subgraph. So indexers are actually waiting for curators to spot the the, the, the subgraph that are going to generate query fees. Why do you say that? And how important do you think the work of curators will be over the long term? Yeah, well, curation started like last year uh, or like 10 months ago. And we have only seen like 2% of total numbers of subgraphs uh, migrate to minutes. Uh, half of them are not being utilized. So we now have more than 15k subgraphs on um, on the hosted servers and they have to migrate to mainnet by the first quarter of 2023. So yeah, we will need a lot of curators to analyze those subgraphs when they migrate to mainnet. Uh, we will need a lot of uh, curators to signal to signal and spot the good subgraphs. Mm-hmm.